shuffling What is up guys, it is Injustice Gaming here bringing you back another episode of Be A GM. As you can see, we're the Toronto Maple Leafs. Um, we are 4-4-1, and one. not that bad to start off with, but today I think I either want to do some trades or uh, we're going to go uh, get, go ahead and uh, resume the season. Um, we're not doing that bad. As you can see, Phil Kessel, Nikolai Kuhlman, JVR are injured. Uh, I turned off injuries for obvious reasons. I just don't feel like dealing with that. And... Uh, what I'm thinking of, I'm thinking of either getting Jeff Skinner or I feel like getting Jordan Eberle. Now, um, I don't want to have to sacrifice too much because uh, I'm telling you right now, if I do have to give up, like, if I do have to give up, like, a big player like maybe Phil Kessel for someone like Jeff Skinner, I wouldn't mind. But I haven't seen, uh, I haven't seen too much of Jeff Skinner, so, uh, Maybe, maybe, uh, maybe not. So, uh, Jeff Skinner is in Carolina. Let's go to that place really quick. And, uh, let's go Rick Nash. No, I'm joking. Uh, let's check out, uh, Jeff Skinner. See, he's 20, and he's a pretty good guy. Look at this guy. Sexy-ass mother trucker. Um, I would like to see this player's info. Let's check him out right now. Um, as you can see, his slap shot accuracy shooting. He's, like, four and a half in about everything except defense. Which is uh, really good. And uh, if we were to compare him to Phil Kessel or someone like that. I don't know who we want to trade. But let's see what Carolina is looking for. Uh, yes. They are looking for a defenseman. Which is really good. We could try giving them Carl Gunnarsson. Um, that's actually uh, something we could try doing. Let's just try go back to uh, left wingers. And let's try giving them Carl Gunnarsson. Because I think uh, that'll that'll do it. If it's not Carl Gunnarsson then... Uh, then we'll just do that. Let's just check out the player info for, kill for Phil Kessel. See, he's pretty good in everything except physical and defense. Um, but uh, I'd rather have a rounded off player like uh, like Jeff Skin. Let's see if this trade goes through. Will it go through? And oh, they're unwilling to take part. We would could live. Let's try. Uh, you know what? Let's try giving them something else. Morgan Riley. Um. No way, no way, no way. Um, we gotta give them something, cause like I think they're not gonna take this. So uh, you think they'll take uh, JVR? Well, whatever. We're just gonna. Well, let's just take out our lines first. Let's uh, check out our lines, cause our lines last episode were really sloppy. Uh, we're just gonna check that out. View lines. Now nah, we're gonna edit. Actually, we're gonna edit. Edit line, see? So, uh, Dion Phaneuf, John Michael Owls, Ryan O'Brien, and Cody Franzen. Now, the thing I'm thinking of is either we trade John Michael Lyles and Ryan O'Brien as a package. Now, then I could bring up... No, no, no. We trade John Michael Lyles, and then I could bring up, uh, I could bring up Morgan O'Reilly. And then, uh, we could basically get someone that's good for, uh, John Michael Lyles. But, uh, I don't know what we're gonna do yet. See, they got a lot of... Like, there's a lot of players I could go for as of right now, but uh, I do not know who I want to go for as of right now. Salary cap. Let's try going for Jordan Eberle. Actually, that, that's going to be pretty sick if we can get Jordan Eberle. See, Jordan Eberle, he's about 22. Let's check out his uh, stats. Yeah, see, he's really good, except when it comes to physical, but I can understand that. But uh, that's okay. Um, who we could, what's, what's Edmonton looking for? Let's just check that out right now. They're looking for a goalie, a starter goalie. So if we give, we could give them Jim Reimer basically. And, uh, we could invest into another goalie. I could see that happening. So let's check if, uh, we can get Jordan Eberle. We'll throw in, um, James Reimer. And we could throw in, where's Reimer? See, cause we could bring up this guy, but he's 26, which is not good. Or we could bring G Sparks. Which, uh, he's only 19, so there's still a lot of room. Let's see his potential, actually. Yeah, see, his potential is a 3.5, so that's not going to be good. Uh, James Reimer is a 4, but uh, we're going to put James Reimer down. And we're going to give them John Michael Lyles. Let's see if they'll accept this trade. Where's John Michael Lyles? Uh, John Michael Lyles. Where are you, John Michael Lyles? There you are. John Michael Lyles. Um, where is he? There he is. Let's check if uh, they'll take this. Oh no no, it doesn't it doesn't match up. So this is a four. 
Okay, we need to get someone who has about 2 million salary. Which uh, we're going to have to find. Let's check if well, we can get someone with 2 million salary. Anybody with 2 million salary? Um, doo -doo 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 anybody? See, all the people that have big names have the good salary, you know? And I'm not willing to... And Grabowski, could we do that? Yeah, but then we have to get something from them. So maybe we'll take Ryan Smith. But then they're about a little bit. And just give us like a rookie. Just give us a rookie or something. Like that. There we go. But if they approve this, then I think this is a really good trade on our part. We are getting Jordan Eberle, but we are losing Grabowski. Let's check. I question whether you looked at our trading blocks or plus. It's totally unwilling to give up. What? See, like if... Let's say I take out John Michael Lyles. Let's, let's take out this player right here. Um... Yes, let's just uh, go back to the trading block. We'll take out John Michael Lyles. We'll put in James Reimer. And we will put in someone else. Because let's check out the trading block again. Because I know I know this is a bad time to be doing this. See, they want to start a goalie. We can do that. And uh, they'll give us forwards and a goalie. See, they they just want to give up Ryan Smith and Cabby Hoolan. But uh, players on the block. See, these guys are between 30 and 50. Which means uh, we're not going to get that. So if we could give them... Because the thing is, you know, let's just not trade any players right now. Let's just continue with the season. Uh, we'll think of that later. If you guys want to put down a trade request down below, tell me uh, what players are good. Tell me what players are bad. And I'll sure to accept them. I'll obviously do them in the video. I have nothing to lose and nothing to gain. I'm a GM, baby. I can do whatever I want. Come on, Pittsburgh. Come on, baby. Can we beat Pittsburgh? Come on, come on. You guys got this? Oh, we lose it 3-1. Come on. I'm thinking, I'm thinking if we should trade Phil Kessel. It's just... Oh, Kovichuk. Can we beat the Kovichucks? Oh my gosh, we lose 2-1. It's We're 4-5. and five. We're 4-5-2. and two. Not bad, not bad, but definitely not good either. Come on. Oh, oh we're 5-5-2. Five, five and two. Not bad. Come on, boys. You got this. Come on, boys. Come on. Oh my god. We're losing games left and right. We need to build something up. Come on, boys. I know you got this. Oh, yes. There we go. Win against Pittsburgh. Take that, Sidney Crosby. Okay. Reversing Ottawa. Oh, my gosh. The nation's capital. But we're the nation's team. Come on. Beat them, boys. Ayo. Hey, there you go, boys. You got it. You got it. You got it. What was the score? One, two. Boom, boom, boom. James Reimer. I love you. Okay. What am... Okay. Um, as of right now, I was going through this in my head. Um, if we view our lines right now, um, NHL, obviously... And if we go to our fourth line, I was thinking we could I, we could try to get Yarmir Yager. I'm not saying we can, but uh, maybe we can get Yarmir Yager. I'm going to try doing that right now. Not GM Tracker. Sorry. I'm going to go to uh, GM Options. And if we can get Yarmir Yager, this, this would be really good for our fourth line. Let's try to find him. He's in Boston, right? Did they do that uh, trade? I think he is in Boston. Let's go back. Boston, there we go. Let's try to find Yarmir Yager. Yarmir, yeah, Yarmir Yager should be here in forwards. Come on, yeah, there we go. Yarmir Yager, he's about four point, and we could trade him for Grabowski, which I wouldn't mind. Let's see if they accept it. I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth as if we are. Boston gladly accepts. Yes, beautiful. So now we do have Yarmir Yager on our team. Um, let's go to coaching options. Let's edit our lines. Let's put in Yarmir Yager. Um, JVR, Jamie McClemon. Yeah, see, now we brought up Leo Komarov. So now we can just put in Yarmir Yager in there. There we go. Yarmir Yager. We've got him on our line. Uh, Jay McClemon, he's going to be pretty good being up here. And uh, he's not going to be that bad. JVR, Jay McClemon, Nikolai Kuhlman. Or maybe we could put Yarmir Yager. Um, switch him with Nikolai Kuhlman. So now we got a pretty decent third line. Not really that bad. Then we got MacArthur, Bozak, and... No, 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 no. We got double Yager, Yarmir Yager. So, um... Either we could uh, switch the player, because I don't want to have Yarmir Yager playing on both lines. Um, so Yarmir Yager's here, JVR, Nikolai Kuhn, and Matt Fran. I guess we could put Leo Komarov, I guess. Yeah, we'll put Leo Komarov over there. Yarmir Yager here, and then uh, not that bad. So it's not a bad line. Uh, of course, we have Lupul, Kadri, and Kessel. Uh, Komarov, Bozak, and MacArthur. I'm not liking a left wing, so maybe we could try to get a left winger. Not bad. Uh, 
because you have edited your lines your assistant coach is now set to minimal okay and uh, let's keep going we now that we've got Jarmir Yager it's gonna be pretty good so we sent down Mike Koska oh my god review progress now but it's okay congratulations on earning GM rookie status it's cool you know I'm a pretty good rookie goal rookie a pretty good rookie GM actually not that bad after we were done simulating I think we're gonna call it quits and I'll thank you guys for watching and all that good jazz and uh, yeah Oh, we win a game. There we go against Colorado. Come on, boys. We got to make that playoff push. We got to make a name for ourselves. Come on, boys. There you go. Nine, five, and four. Not bad, but not good either. Uh, next, next uh, episode. We definitely have to try to get a big name out there. Definitely, we have to get a big name. Oh, we can beat New Jersey. Oh, there we go. New Jersey. New Jersey. We just beat the shit out of you. Um, Toronto. Mark Fraser is available to play in the team's next game. Yes. Let's put. Oh no no no! I'm talking about. I want to bring out uh, him next. I want to bring him up um, up to the Leafs. I gotta see his potential though. So there we go, boys. Come on! Oh, we lose to Winnipeg. My God, we run like a little win streak right there. Come on, you got this, boys. Against Montreal, you gotta make a name for yourselves. We gotta beat the shit out of Montreal. Come on, boys. Oh my gosh, we lose against Montreal. That's okay. That's okay. Not bad, but uh. We need to definitely work on our... Oh, and we lose to Buffalo. There it goes, boys. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe you guys did that. Okay, so we are finished, uh, and we are 11, 8, and 4. Not that bad, but uh, we can still work on it. We have no injuries at this point. Like I said, I turned off the injuries. And I'd like to thank you guys for watching. If you guys want to request anything down below for GM time is to do, then I'll be gladly willing to do that. And uh, thank you guys for watching. And as always, guys, peace.